Hey everybody, welcome back. I'm so glad you're here with me today. Today I have a collab video with some of my fellow geeks and beauties because we all have the Sanderson Sisters palette and they're all probably going to do different looks. This is my kind of version because I don't really do looks or tutorials or anything because I suck. I'm none. I'm just a novice. And um, this is from Pretties for Your Face. You've heard me mention them before, but now I have a code for you. Uh, use code SNEFFY, S-N-E-F-F-I-E. -E. I'll have it down below and you can save 20% off your order. And the disclosure is, um, I get some product back for every uh, amount, certain amount made by a sale. So that's, that's the only disclosure. And they have some really cool products that I wanna try. I've been wanting to get the Wreck-It Ralph palette they have, I, forget, I think it's called the Sugar Rush palette, and she has a Felix Fix It fixing spray and a Wreck It Ralph remover, <laughs> makeup remover. So yeah, but this is the Sanderson Sisters palette, and the art is really cute. And on the back, it looks like this with the colors, and. There's book. I'll, I'll swatch it for you. But I'm telling you, it doesn't swatch as good as it does on the eyes. That's book and Mary. And Sarah. Sarah swatches horribly, but it looks awesome on the eyes. And Winifred. That green is awesome. And uh, what is this called? Black Candle Flame is very pigmented. So that's what they look like swatch wise. I gotta get it off my fingers first before we play with it but yeah I have already put down some concealer we're going light today concealer and eye primer that's all we've done so far and we're gonna start off I'm gonna set everything uh, Book is a nice matte brown, and it, this is much bigger than I imagined it was. And there's five pans in here, and a really nice mirror. <laughs> and it, the mirror is very nice. I'm gonna take that book shade and just kind of set the primer. And I like that in the other palette she has, I've heard this is the first time she's done like a transition-like shade. So, and the owner's name is Meg. She's a very nice gal. And I definitely want to own more of her makeup because I love creative stuff. I have these two bottom colors down here. I just got this one. I didn't get to use it yet, but I got this as a freebie too. Uh, this is um, Enchanted Forest, and this is Frog Face. I haven't had a chance to use Frog Face yet. Um, all right, so I got this down. I'm going to clean off this brush in case I need it again. And I am going to start my whole idea is kind of like a flame that's my kind of inspiration I'm getting right now and I am going to start off with 
the shade Mary. I love this shade. It's a bright orange. It's what made me really want this in the first place. So we're just going to swipe that across the lid. And I am going to wet my brush. I've got to find it. And mm, I think I'll choose a different brush too. I really need to reorganize everything in here. It's a mess. You know, like sometimes things just get out of control. And it's like they get so far out of control that you're like... When am I going to get it in control? <laughs> I should have done this months ago. And that kind of thing. So, all right. And I have used this a few times before. There we go. Mm. It's not popping out much because I use that brown. I shouldn't have used that brown. Oh, well. We'll work in packing it on. It's easier for me to look into this mirror than it is the big one. And then we'll work it over here. So, the little fact about me. I, this is a Sanderson Sisters palette, which means it's from Hocus Pocus. And I didn't want to get this at first because I hate that movie. I just don't like it. <laughs> and then I was like, oh, but these colors are so pretty. And then I, I kept seeing friends get it. I'm like, crap, I have to get this. Um... And it was just really funny how it was. Um, I just, I never, and people are like, how can you hate Hocus Pocus? And it's like, when I was in college, my roommate, I loved her. She was one of my besties. Well, one of my roommates. And uh, she would watch it a lot. And when I don't like something and I have to see it or hear it a lot, I just don't like it. And then... The song, like, whatever song they sing in the movie drives me crazy. Like, it just gives me the heebie-jeebies. And she would just, like, it would be silent in the room. And she had it on her computer and she'd turn it on. And, like, I'd throw something. <laughs> next, my idea is the next part you see in a flame is kind of red. So I'm using that purple that didn't look great as a swatch but you'll see soon when you put it into your crease don't give me that shit about shimmer not in the crease uh-uh we don't do that here we play by our own rules and you kind of just kind of stick it in kind of like how there's like that nook in there so you could kind of like intensify it and bring it like halfway over And sometimes I'm really simple with the looks. Sometimes I'm not. Sometimes I'm adventurous. Sometimes I'm like, I don't know how I feel today. But I hope you're having a great day. I wonder if this how, like, if Bob Ross was being born now. Like, say there's, like, a new Bob Ross out there. Just, like, he's gonna start, like, doing his own videos on YouTube. And, like, he talks like that, like... Like this when they're doing their makeup or he's doing art. That'd be kind of cool, wouldn't it? Or am I just being weird? And see how it kind of looks like fire? Like a flame? Now, I kind of want to use more. Like... Like, in my head, I'm trying to go through this because I'm afraid of using black a lot. I could do another look sometime using the black. But the two color is simple. But I want to find 
my liner brush and kind of do what I need to do because I like using it to put color or something. Please tell me this is my liner brush. That's not my liner brush. Hmm. See, and all my brushes are mixed up now. I need to get a grip girl. Hmm. I have a smudge brush, so I think I'm gonna take the green and go under my eye a little with it. Um, it doesn't want to work well with this brush. This brush usually works well with that's a little thick for me. No, that no. See, and we make mistakes here and learn. So That made the line a bit thinner, which I like better than the smudge. I really got to find that liner brush. Here's a liner brush. So I could kind of do the same on this side. And you don't have to bring it all the way in. But if you want to, you can. And one of my lights is getting in the way. Hold on. There we go. Because sometimes my hand isn't steady. But a green on the lower lash looks nice, I think. Instead of using black. I think it came out okay. I only used three colors, but you don't always need to use every color in your arsenal. You could be as simple as you want, girl. And now I'm just going to finish off the face with some mascara and brow stuff. I just have my brow stuff. And check out the other girls in the club because they are awesome and talented and much better than me, I think. Oh, uh, where is it? What was I even looking for? Oh, man. Um, my mascara that I had gotten out and my brow mascara. I'm very iffy on this brow mascara because wand is longer than the packaging or the whatever you want to do with it but I'm not a fan I rather oh, I should have got that I made an order tonight and I should have got the essence gimme brow I totally forgot I could have got oh oh well next time next time I make an order I'll do that and probably get a new spoolie too. I need a new spoolie. And I'm hopefully going to be getting my eye brows done, like waxed, soon. Now, I want to take, I usually take the end of my cloth and go that way. Instead of like using tape like some people do, I just find it easier. And less of a hassle. And I think what I need now is I need to go back and get the brush that I did have that I used in the first place that I can't find now for, uh, there we go. I'll just clean this one off. 
and I'm gonna dip back into that brown and kind of just soften it. I wish I had a different brush. Wait, there's the brush. And bring it up a little higher, but then I'm still gonna take it down a little bit. Because it's easier to clean up, I think, than the shape. There, now you have like the shape I was going for. Now, I don't know where my eyelash curler is. But, I know I have my mascara around here. There we go. Laura Mercier. I don't know where my superhero is right now. And the mascara just kind of ties everything together. Makes a little... I've noticed it starting you when I started using it it kind of makes things pop even though it kind of terrifies me having something this close to my eyeball like are there any beauty products you're afraid to use I think next year might start eyeliner don't know yet don't know yet might start eyeliner next year so that might be next year's adventure this year was mascara so we'll see and that oh we need a highlight girl i'm just gonna pull one out and this is not the one i want mm. i wish i could find i'll use this one and i will take paper brush and go into the gold and the yellow and then I like to buff it out a bit anyway that was a playtime with the Sanderson sisters palette I hope you enjoyed this I hope you check out the other girls and what they did and uh, go get yourself some pretties for your face because they sell a lot of stuff. That's awesome. And my code will be down below along with the other participants. Have a great night. Bye.